Ja. Yep. So, we are here. <laughs> at the Karakara Caves. So, that's, that's a walking track. Like an easy, easy handling 20 minutes return walk, mm. roughly. Yes, Nice bushwalk. I was wondering what you're filming, the ground. Huh? <laughs> it's a tropical walk. Look. Look. Of all the dry grass. Dry grass, burnt yep. tree trunks. The wet. Which wet? The wet season of grown and Growth. destruction. Growth and destruction. Yeah, yeah pretty dry in the moment. Yeah, because it's winter. Dry season. Yeah, dry season. Mm. That will be different in summertime. Well, in summer there are no tours in the Katakata Caves, no. but you can still access the park, apparently, according to the website. Yeah, it depends on the weather. Ah, yeah, of course, quite <laughs> in general. Okay, what is a piggy beggar? A piggy beggar is, a piggy a, beggar. is one of those... Uh, the bromelias. Yeah. One of the ones that sit on the back of other plants, like you can yeah. see here. And the freeloaders are mistletoes. The ones that, you know, take advantage advantage of others yeah. without paying. Yeah. <laughs> freeloaders. Get off my property. <laughs> uh. Nice round walk here. Not too, yeah. not too um, exhausting, but the caves are not accessible for people with disabilities, like with mobile disabilities. That's why I uh, have to wear uh, closed shoes. Yeah. No songs allowed. No crocs allowed. It's recommended. It's not forbidden. No, it's it's not recommended. Not, it's not allowed. <laughs> anyway. The round circle here, the, the walkway. That's nice. I'm wondering if we can get a coffee or a cappuccino over there. What do you think? Mm. Hmm. Awesome. Bladwood. That's the bladwood they think about. They think about in the trees, uh, in the songs. Bladwood. bladwood Isn't there a course. song about uh, a song from John Williamson as well yeah. about bladwood? Um, of course. Talking. And there's um, blood running out like here. Looks like blood. Yeah, looks like blood. Nice trees. And it looks beautiful anyway because of the blue sky, the blue winter sky. I love it, the contrast of the colors. But you can clearly see it's not autumn, it's winter. Everything's dry. And south. Uh, New South Wales, Queensland even, they had snow recently yeah. inland, which is not common anyway. We made the right decision, escaping the cold. Yeah. And the result is we are sweating. Oh, not, not in the moment. Not in the moment, but um, yeah, we had already, day today. we had some very warm days already. Not much left from that tree. But it's still standing. Eh? Still standing, but it's not living anymore, I guess. It looks nice. Still solid. It is still solid, but there's no life in it anymore, no, I would no. say. But uh, you can see here uh, the most. In, in Europe, the most. Um, Commercial constructions like swimming, so indoor swimming pools and all that stuff. Um, the roof pattern and the um, they're all made the beams. from the beams. They're making from timber, so laminated timber. So there's a high high uh, pressed uh, glued 
timber construction and with the fire um, they will hold the roof up so much longer, I think three times longer than a steel construction. Steel will uh, melt. Is, yeah, now they're melting, they're, they're bent, they the bent, get old yeah, and yeah. They're, they're, they're bent, they're not yeah. melting. Yeah, and they, they, don't, they don't hold they the roof don't. anymore. No. Yeah. yeah, they say it's a 20 minute walk, a turn walk, but yeah, it's yeah. not even 10 minutes if you have long legs. Yeah. <laughs> Just made it in 10 minutes. 11 minutes. Yep. Here we go, steps again. Just following the crowd.
was it good? Awesome. Interesting. Yep. Awesome. Very interesting. Different to the caves in Germany. Yeah. Like the one that we have in Mars. Highly recommend this one. Yep. This one is uh, one hour, thirty-five dollars. Thirty-five dollars for adult. Yeah. Tour, tour guide. Yeah. What is the kids? I think nineteen or something. Eh? Kids nineteen. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, that was good. And yeah, very interesting. Um, I'm thinking of removing the leather band from my head. It's annoying me. A lot of people remove the leather band. Not sure. I have to find out. This is a comfortable head, but the leather band makes me sweat a lot. So, I'll see. Josh. What do you think? What should I do with my head? With that thing here, the fat thing on my head. <laughs> Remove the leather band or keep it? What is your uh, recommendation? Let, let me know, or anyone out there, if you have experience with um, making your head more comfortable, your Akubras. What have you done to make it super comfortable? Just tell me, please. I want to know. We uh, practice we the word. <laughs> we are at where? <laughs>